סוד שבתפארת. And we are about to conclude the week of Tiferet, which we explained uh, time after time. Tiferet is referring to beauty, to, to specific type of beauty. And Yesod Sheba Tiferet is when beauty is attached to beauty. And I'm not talking about right now that Miss America is dating uh, uh, Mr. America. That's not what I'm talking about. Because sometimes in the world of uh, Hollywood, modeling, cinema, they, it looks like the stars are attracted to the stars. And it's not what I'm talking about at all. Uh, one way of explaining is that when you look in nature, there are many types of beauty. If you travel around the world, you'll see beautiful... Uh, Uh, views, a beautiful forests, animals, oceans, so many different things that you see the beauty in nature. If you look at things individually, then you see that each thing individually has its own beauty. But where do you see the ultimate beauty? When they all come together. The beauty of each element separately is what's connecting them together. Now, what is the connecting part is the common denominator that they all have that Hashem created them. And when I'm saying thing, I'm saying two, two aspects, two elements, two creatures. But everything is attracted to each other. If you take now one flower, for example, the flower is beautiful, no doubt. Put it now in a whole garden full of flowers. Now you see even more beauty, how the red matches the purple and the blue and the white. And sometimes you... Uh, 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 how do you call it? Uh, you dive in the water. I used to dive many times uh, deep in the water. How do you call it? Not uh, scuba diving. So sometimes you see one fish. Okay, it's a nice fish. When you see suddenly a lot of fish and they're together and merging and moving, like wow, you see the beauty completely changes when everybody is uh, is uh, uh, so to say accommodating each other. This is one example out of many. But what is the connecting between them? is what's the common denominator, that they all are created by the Kadosh Baruch Hu. But really, the translation to Yesod is foundation, but we know that Yesod is uh, uh, the same as a, as, a, uh, as a covenant. So I call it a hook, because that's how you, how you get th two things together. Yesod Shebatiferet is the covenant in beauty. When two beautiful things, they get connected. If you have two separate things, then beautiful, and they're not connected, then they're missing their, uh, their uh, ability to connect together and become even more beautiful. Now, when does the beauty in the creation, in nature, in all around us, comes into play? When does it come uh, express, to express itself? Is when it's united. Like I said, separate things, they might be beautiful, but put them all together, then it's expressing the real unity and the beauty how each uh, individual will accommodate and support each other.